Come to scenes we'd like to see. So if everyone can make their way over to the performance area, please. I'll read out this week's topics, then we'll see what our panels can come up with. Okay, here we go. The first topic is unlikely lines from a blockbuster movie. I am Thor, protector of Asgard, god of thunder, and I have lost my hammer. <laughs> Great hell, where in this Wix can I buy a new one? <laughs> ah. I see dead people. All the time. I work at Dignitas. <laughs> they brought the dinosaurs back to life. Welcome to the best exotic Marigold Hotel. <laughs> <laughs> Unlikely things to hear on a travel programme. I'm Danny Dyer, and welcome to Italy's quaintest vineyards. <laughs> <laughs> This truly is the best way to see Portsmouth, while looking at a picture of it when you're in Paris. <laughs> <laughs> when you travel, it's important to immerse yourself in the culture. So here I am in Malia, being fingered outside the Laman flag. <laughs> on likely things to hear on breakfast TV. A lot of people ask me how I stay awake at this time. Well, you know what they say, early to bed, crack cocaine in the morning. <laughs> Later on, we'll be meeting a man who has to go through 50 steps before he can orgasm. All that to come. <laughs> now we're going over to the kitchen where Chef Tony will be cooking up an excuse for why he's been texting my wife. <laughs> lines you wouldn't read in a romantic novel. He felt a swelling down there. Shouldn't have tried to bang a beehive. <laughs> I want to role-play. I'll be a prince from a mythical land, and you be your sister. <laughs> <laughs> the debutantes paraded in the ballroom in front of the rich landowners, and the master of ceremonies proudly proclaimed, Let the Darcys fondle the arses! <laughs> <laughs> Rejected exam questions. Using examples of Michelangelo's work, write 500 words on why he was the best turtle. <laughs> you may now commence your anal sex exam. Please turn over. <clears throat> if Jay-Z is unfortunate enough to have a problem with a bitch, how many problems does Jay-Z now have? <laughs> Unlikely thing to say when running for US president. I know the value of family because I sold one of my children to pay for this campaign. <laughs> <laughs> if you elect me America's first colorblind president, I will do everything I can to uphold the values of the brown, white, and green. <laughs> <laughs> I want to put more boots on the ground in Afghanistan and also two more branches of paper chase. <laughs> I am American through and through. Cut me, and I will shoot you in the face. <laughs> Things you wouldn't hear on a news programme. As I stand here in this village, where the water is ridden with disease and human faeces, we have to ask ourselves one question. Why did I choose to wear flip-flops? <laughs> <laughs> is there sexism at the BBC? Let's ask Sally Johnson, who's our lovely smiles and pretty cakes correspondent. <laughs> Unlikely agony aunt letters. My girlfriend's livid because I got drunk and did a shit on the roof. Please tell me, how can I wipe the slate clean? <laughs> my wife wants us to experiment in the bedroom, but last time we did that, the Bunsen burner singed my pubes. <laughs> 
<laughs> Dear Deirdre, how do I turn off caps lock? <laughs> <laughs> Commercials that never made it to air. Are your pets so wonderful that they're actually tiring you out? Have a break. Have a shit cat. <laughs> Abby has strong teeth, boundless energy, and a shiny coat. She's the best prostitute in London. <laughs> There's now a free gift at the bottom of every box of Frosties. Type 2 diabetes. <laughs> Crack-flavoured Pringles. Once you pop, you really can't stop. <laughs> Unlikely things to hear in hospital. Yeah. He's gone into cardiac arrest. Get the defibrillator. The defibrillator. <laughs> the defibrillator. Oh, it's too late. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> this is the discussion group for people who've broken bones. Welcome to Snapchat. <laughs> <laughs> We've given your wife gas and air. And by that, I mean I farted and the nurse opened a window. <laughs> Unlikely film trailers. Tantric Sex, the movie, not coming soon. <laughs> In his most important role to date, Danny Dyer is Emmeline Pankhurst. <laughs> Look at the rest of these tots, he's pissed off! <laughs> In a land where nothing costs more than a pound. It's pound land. <laughs> In a world where they only sell PCs. It's PC world. <laughs> Very good. OK, next topic. Unlikely things to hear on a makeover show. Welcome to Straight Eye for the Straight Guy, where the advice is always spray links on your crotch. <laughs> <laughs> what your hair needs is volume and lots of body. So here's Brian Blessed. <laughs> Lines you wouldn't hear in a TV detective show. On entering the house, we found a feline jammed into a Xerox machine. We think it was a copycat crime. <laughs> <laughs> and according to the coroner's report, he had his head removed and a wedge of lime shoved down his neck. Sorry, that's the coroner's report. <laughs> <laughs> there is some semen at the crime scene. What can I say? I love forensics. <laughs> I'm so sorry for your loss, Mrs. Trump. Now, firstly, can you think of anyone who didn't have a motive to do this? <laughs> Things you didn't hear at the Olympics. Look at that masterful control of his javelin. He really is the best streaker we've had all year. <laughs> and his penis has slapped the top of the bar. That is a straight ban from Weatherspoons. <laughs> Unlikely lines from a children's book. As Noddy looked at his new friends, Rampant Rabbit and Linda the Love Egg, he realised he was in a very different kind of toy town. <laughs> from under the bridge came the voice of the troll. Wow, women can't be Ghostbusters, send! <laughs> There's an Indian in the cupboard. I think he's hiding from UKIP. <laughs> I've been in this cupboard for bloody ages. <laughs> <laughs> OK, the next topic is... Things you wouldn't hear on a quiz show. We asked you for things that start with an E. You said, a great night out with the lads. <laughs> <laughs> Name, Keith Vaz. I mean, Jim. <laughs> Occupation, MP. I mean, washing machine salesman! <laughs> Well, we've given the contestants their meth and sent them to Hampton Court. Welcome to the Crystal Maze. <laughs> <laughs> Things you wouldn't hear on Crime Watch. The suspect defecated on Boris Johnson's doorstep. Witnesses described the man as an absolute legend. <laughs> <laughs> the man broke into Battersea Dog's home and released all the dogs. Police are desperately searching for leads. <laughs> Oh, no! 
a city up north has gone missing. It begins with L and is great. Police are desperately looking for leads. <laughs> Were you in the Weatherspoons at 9am? If you were, we want you to contact us. There was no crime, we just want to work out what went wrong in your life. <laughs> the victim's name was Jehovah. Police are looking for witnesses. <laughs> on likely lines from a fantasy film. Your Majesty, I have ridden here for two weeks on horseback to deliver this important message from your brother. <laughs> <laughs> Thor. John Thor. <laughs> and I am a Morse god. <laughs> After travelling across the dark seas and desolate plains, finally I am home. I left my keys at Clive's. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that, uh, and the point's going to end. You and James. <laughs>